There are so many things and experiences and very unusual experiences that Holy Prophet and the Sahabi Kiram they went through that is not recorded in books. And so many different kinds of knowledges also that is not contained in books. They contain in the hearts and it is passed down. This tradition that you're speaking about, first, it has to be, uh, you have to ask yourself the question, this tradition, for what? What is the reason? What is the purpose of this tradition? If it's just because, well, we just like it and we want to practice it, no, it's not good enough. This is a knowledge, and this is a lost or a hidden, a secret knowledge, and it will come when the time is right for the purposes of fighting against the evil, that's all. But don't think now that we're going to try to find, we're going to make certain movements and da da da, and that time we're going to be ready. No. The war that is going to be against to, uh, the evil and the Dajjal, it is not going to be a regular war. It is going to be a war that will involve high spirituality and spiritual powers. Those kinds of spiritual powers, you won't be able to get it now. You're going to collect that power into a battery. But you're not going to use that battery. There's nothing for you to use it now. If people are using it now, it's only for showing off. It is not what it's been created for. It's wasting. So, they are covered. Sit and make zikr. Connect yourself to Allah. Submit. You're making your battery to be more and more powerful. That time when the fighting comes, whatever that is for you, that whatever that is your right, whatever that is part of your heritage, it will come to you. <coughs> Inshallah. It will come to you. And it will be not for curiosity's sake, it will be to fight against the evil, to fight against the Antichrist, to fight against the Dajjal. It's not just for interest and curiosity stake. So, we want that, inshallah. How are you going to get ready for that? Like I said, worship, stepping on your ego, following a shaykh, inshallah. It may be easy for us. It's not going to be, may it be easy for us. Those are very difficult days ahead of us. Don't take it lightly. Namam. Bashka. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. <laughs>